Cindy's mother trucker dude. Ah. <laughs> like butt cheek on stick. <laughs> like a butt cheek on a stick. Whoa. Oh, it's thunder. Oh, oh hey. Wow. Oh, oh wow. Bowser's. Cool. That's pretty shocking. Hello. Uh, 360 cam. <laughs> it's kind of trippy. I haven't started love yet. You. Love you too. I was counting to you. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I was talking to our audience, but oh, you, guys, okay. you count. Oh, thanks. You might as well. This will be uh, evidence in court yeah. of the harassment I face every day. <laughs> <laughs> That's the A of harassment. <laughs> Dubai was lit. I don't know that video. I'll look at that video. Yeah. Isn't Dubai like the richest country in the world? Yeah. Well, I know where I'm moving to. Yeah. Oh, I'm moving to Dubai. Bye. Bye-bye. I'm going to Dubai. I'm starting. Good morning, Ephrata. I'm Sam. And I'm Seth. By the way, I just took a selfie. Follow my snap. Oh, what the? Okay. I beat him. All right. This is terrible. It's Friday, January 20th. He tries to remove socks and punches the flag. That was my entire study. I don't know what I'm doing right now. <laughs> <laughs> that was actually just really relatable. It was just I really awkward. That. I felt that on I'm not funny. I'm not funny. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not funny. <laughs> All the pasty hair just coming up out of nowhere. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, sorry for the awkward. Coding contest registration forms are due today. Please return your completed team registration form to the main office by the end of the day today. The third annual EASD coding contest will be held in the high school cafeteria on one of three days in March. Dates will be determined in February after all registrations have been counted. Please contact Mrs. Hooper if you have any questions. Students are reminded that today, Friday, January 26th, is the last day to drop a course without receiving a withdrew failing mark. All forms must have a written essay along with the parent signature. The deadline is today at 3 o'clock. Attention juniors! Do you enjoy decorating for special occasions? Do you have excellent taste in food and music? Yeah. I, I do. If so, you might be the perfect person to help plan this year's prom. The first meeting of the 2018 prom committee will be on Wednesday, January 31st from 2.40 to 3.10 p.m. in room 209. The committee will continue to meet every Wednesday afternoon through May 2nd. Don't let us down. See Mrs. Schubert in room 209 if you have any questions. This year's event promises to be out of this world. Oh, now yeah. to Mary with the news. Oh, hey. <laughs> oh. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? All right. Larry Nassar, the former doctor for the USA national gymnastics team, has been sentenced up to 175 years in prison after over 156 girls gave testimony, corroborated accusations of sexual misconduct and assault. Nassar pled guilty after being offered a plea bargain that would drop his minimum amount of possible years to 40, a low number that he is unlikely to receive. In case you've been living under a Dwayne Johnson, congressional Democrats and Republicans were able to come to agreement on a temporary funding measure on Monday that would fund the government for the next 17 days, officially ending the shutdown, at least for a little while. Unless they can use this time to come to an agreement over the controversial DACA program, the extra time will not be particularly useful. Maybe today's day in history will give some insight into this year's Super Bowl. On this day in 1986, the Chicago Bears beat the New England Patriots 46 to 10. Not only is this the biggest margin in between two team scores in Super Bowl history, but the Bears also gained the record number of points in the game as well. Coached by Mike Ditka, who had been a tight end for Chicago, the Bears quickly gained momentum after New England had scored the first points in the game and successfully beat the dumb old Patriots. Oh. That one goes out to my dad, Don Miller, the biggest Bears fan I know. XOXO. I'll <laughs> <laughs> over to Ryan and Ben with lunch. That's not really in it. <laughs> he gets cut off. The audio is bad again. But sometimes technical difficulties. Kind of like. Hold <laughs> 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 on. Memories in my head. <laughs> <laughs> so what happened? I don't know. The mic kept cutting out. Kids, <laughs> like, let me know when the thing. All right, thanks. Don't miss the ball. I'm I'm trying to do it perfectly. <laughs> what? Why are these guys keep switching it? <laughs> oh. And <laughs> sports resorts. Girls and boys swimming both feet LS. 
The girls are now the only undefeated team in the section. <laughs> Mary Miller, rep it! And the boys are now tied for second. Effort defeated Wilson, 495-493. Uh, the top shooters were Nicole Johnson, 101 center, Jill Potts, 99, Brianna Bauer, 99, Colleen Hurst, 99, and Samantha Hurst, 98, and three centers. Today, bowling is at Henfield. Boys basketball is home versus Donegal. Girls basketball is away at Donegal. And wrestling is away at Garden Spot. Now back to the main desk. <clears throat> Feeling anxious about your plans for Valentine's Day? Well, fret no more. Spend the evening at a dance. Minithon is hosting a Valentine's dance on Saturday, February 10th. Tickets are $7 in advance or $10 at the door on the day of the dance. Ticket sales are Tuesday, February 6th through Friday, February 9th. All the proceeds benefit Four Diamonds. Remember, it's a City Hawkins dance, so girls ask the guys. Kind of like my two friends here. <laughs> One of them just asked the other to the dance. Isn't that cute? Anyway, put your heart on the floor for all to see. Like you said. Due to a scheduling conflict, the group votes next week will be moved back a day. On January 30th, what? Tuesday, and January 31st, Wednesday next week, activities group photos will take place during homeroom. Please stop at your homeroom to check in and then be by, at the auditorium by 7.30 to begin. See the list below for the day your group will be needed. <clears throat> day one is uh, January 30th with German NHS, Leo Club, NHS, Spanish NHS, Student Council, GSA, Link Crew, Quiz Bowl, Avidum, and Ski Club. Day two, which is Wednesday, will be yearbook, newspaper, chess club, FFA, anime, dance team, art honor society, mini thon club, and friends of Rachel. The winners have been announced for the 2018 Lancaster County Young Artist and Scholastic Art Show Awards competition. Yeah. <coughs> After the students receiving awards include with LCYA, the Gold Award, Callie Holloway with Undoing in Digital Photography, Haley Schultz with Above Sea on Earth in Digital Photography, Natalie Zimmerman in sh with Shadows of the Past in Digital Photography, Madison Messner with Geometric Raku Air Plant House with in Ceramics. The Silver Award was Sebra Sebastian Garanda, Drowning in My Own Thoughts, Digital Photography, Carly Ludwig, Distress, Digital Photography, Daniel Piper, Woodland Waters, Digital Photography, and Sadie Grave, Color Cloak Apparel. Honorable mentions are Jeffrey Goldman with Red, Green, and Blue in Digital Photography, Joanna Mansevich with Save It for a Sunny Day in Painting, and Teresa Mall with On Point in Drawing. The Scholastics Honorable Mention was Deandra Martin, Jars of Water, Drawing and Illustration, Deandra Martin, Out of This World, Drawing and Illustration, Deandra Martin, Hand Me Your Perspective, Drawing and Illustration, and Deborah Jeffers, Handmade Paper Rose Shoe Design. Well, Ephrata, it's Friday, so have a good day, and remember, teddy bears. Have a Hagen day. They're in love. <laughs> have a Hagen day. Yes. Very nice. Equivalent to a good day. Oh. Okay. Uh, do I stop it now or do I let it continue no, yes, on? Yes, you are. Can I turn these off now? Yeah. Wait, is Gerald said three six or is the fishbowl one? Okay. You're the fish best. Alright, what should we do in the fishbowl? One of these stuffed animals that you can. What? Ethan. Yeah, you can hit the button then. You can hit the button. All right.